It is one thing to be sick. It is one thing to not be well and you stay home and don't say anything. Praise God. But he's earnestly asking us to lift them in prayer. Amen. And so all the other brothers and sisters, we know that some are overseas. Some are elsewhere. And as a matter of fact, some just not at the place where they should be to be in the house of God but you know Jesus said just before his return there would be a great falling away people would be talking about God they would be talking about God based on their experience based on how many years they've been in the church but when it comes to their connection it comes to their dedication and commitment jesus said many would fall away there would be great apostasy and today every church is feeling the pangs of the prophetic word that jesus left so i am not surprised i am not surprised guess what i am glad that i'm in a Time where I could experience and see the word of Jesus come to pass come on the words of Jesus come to pass and what that tells us is that it's look up time now because any minute now Jesus will put in his appearance amen so don't don't be discouraged if you come and you see a handful Sometimes it up, sometimes it down, sometimes it's 50, sometimes 100, sometimes 20, sometimes 15. Just, just, just know that you're in the house of God. Give God a clap here today. Just know that you are in the house of God. Amen? Amen. Hallelujah. There's a song that I felt led in my heart to sing. Praise God. Hallelujah. And I heard you sing it earlier, praise the God, and I heard Exhorter Karen was touched in my sermon. But you know what God has proven to us one more time is that he's in the midst of Vision Miracle Church of God. He's in the midst of Vision Miracle Church of God. And I want us to clap our hands and sing the song and shake our tambourines. Just shake and make some noise to the Lord. Don't let nobody steal your joy. Come on, somebody. Sing that song for me. Praise God. Hallelujah. Where's your tambour? I don't know 
about you, but I testify. What a mighty God we serve. Oh, hallelujah. What a mighty God we serve. Holy Ghost, thank you, Jesus. Angels bow before Him. Heaven and earth adore Him. What a mighty God. God is for the Lord Somebody shout hallelujah Somebody shout hallelujah Oh thank you What a what I see. Oh my God. I say I'm not moved because by what I see. God is testing our faithfulness. God is testing us. We're in a testing period. Come on somebody. We are in a testing period. We're going through a testing period. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Oh praise God. Hallelujah. There is something locked up in your praise. I know that some of you can't praise God unless you see a crowd. But I thank God that even when there's two or three of us, I am preaching as if I'm preaching to a million. Oh, praise God. Come on, somebody. You don't feel like you want to praise God. You don't feel like you want to open your mouth. You don't feel like you want to do anything. But can I get somebody to shake your tambourine? Clap your hands and open your mouth and give God praise. Give God praise. Give Him praise. Hallelujah. 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 I believe in my heart that a word is coming for somebody. Amen. I say I believe that a word is coming for somebody. Hallelujah. I hear the Spirit of the Lord saying to tell somebody, don't let nobody steal your joy. Don't let nobody steal your joy. Come on, somebody. God has spoken in the learning soon this morning to exhort Karen Walker and she did not know that while I was in the office I was just praising God 
God is speaking in this hour. Praise the Lord. Uh, tell somebody beside you, don't let nobody steal your joy. Uh, some of you not saying anything. Uh, don't let nobody steal your joy. We got some joy thieves up there. We got some joy thieves around. Come on, Shaka. We got some joy thieves around. Come on, young man. Uh, praise God. Glory be to God. I uh, say we got some people that are bent on stealing your joy. Come on, preach with me, no man. Praise God. You got some people that are bent on destroying your peace. Oh, praise the Lord. Oh, but I believe before you sit down, I believe God is ready to do a new thing uh, uh, for all of us. Uh, oh, praise God. God is getting ready to do a new thing. Uh, somebody shout from your belly, a new thing. Uh, I can't hear you. New thing. God is getting ready to do a new thing. Uh, oh, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Uh, double portion. Uh, Oh, uh, uh, but the only way that you're going to get the double portion uh, uh, is to uh, praise God. Uh, you need to know God for yourself. Some people can't praise God today if they don't see a crowd. Uh, some people have to be stimulated. Some people have to be stimulated by other people. But when you have your own praise, uh, when you have, come on, talk with me, no man. When you have your own praise, uh, you don't need nobody to help you. As a matter of fact, you're so anointed that you want to help somebody. Can I get some help in here? I say you're so anointed that you want to help somebody. Somebody give God a praise in here. Somebody give God a praise in here. Somebody say thank you, Jesus. Somebody raise your hands and say thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Oh, praise God. Hallelujah. Oh, Jesus. Somebody call his name. Somebody call his name. Somebody call his name. Somebody call his name. Somebody say, thank you, Jesus. Somebody say, hallelujah. Somebody say, glory. Somebody say hallelujah. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Can I get a witness in the house? Thank you. Can I get a witness in the house? Praise God. Hallelujah. 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 Oh, Jesus. I don't know who it is getting a breakthrough, but somebody's getting a breakthrough. Hallelujah. 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 I don't know who it is, but somebody's getting a breakthrough. Somebody's getting a breakthrough right now in the name of Jesus. I say in the name of Jesus. Somebody shout in the name of Jesus. Somebody say in the name of Jesus. Oh, glory to God. I feel the Holy Ghost in here. Do, do me move by what you see. Do me move by what you feel. Oh, praise God. Hallelujah. 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 You deserve the glory. Let's sing it. And the honor. As we lift our hands in worship. And we pray. No! 
Give the Lord a clap and a praise. Somebody give the Lord a clap and a praise. You may be seated for a few minutes. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. God is ready. Praise the Lord. Praise God. Hallelujah. God is ready to do a new thing for us. But you need to know. You need to know the power of your praise. The enemy is after your joy. Let me say it again, the enemy is after your joy. Because he knows that the joy of the Lord is our strength. Hallelujah. Just turn around and tell somebody, start rejoicing today. Come on, tell somebody, start rejoicing today. Come on, tell somebody, start rejoicing today. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Somebody praise Him. Somebody praise Him. Somebody praise Him. 
Somebody praise him. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Somebody praise the Lord. Somebody praise the Lord. Hallelujah. hallelujah. You know, rejoice always. Pray without ceasing. In everything. In everything. Now, Brother Steve, I need you to let the people hear you. Come on, come on. I need you to let the people hear you. I don't have no typewriter, no computer here. Confirmation. Rejoice always. And pray without ceasing. But the most, one of the most important things is to remember in everything, somebody shout everything. Everything. In everything, learn to give thanks. My God. Everything. For this is the will of God in Christ Jesus for you. Come on. Whatever that thing is, I hear God saying, I've given you a word. It has been confirmed. Uh, uh, give thanks. Give thanks. Yes. You're in it, but give thanks. Come on. You're going through it, give but thanks. give thanks. You're not giving thanks for it. But while you are in it, somebody shout in it. In it, in it, in it. Somebody shout in it. In it. While you are in it, you need to learn to lift up your hands and open your mouth and give God thanks. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You see in that above verse, I want you to take note that it says in everything. In everything. Give thanks. Oh, praise God. In the midst of the trials, what you must do? Can't hear your man. What you must do? In the midst of the attacks. Give thanks. Sometimes the attacks coming from all directions. Come on, give thanks. Sometimes the attack coming from family members. Give thanks. Sometimes the attack coming from frenemies. Give thanks. So-called friends. Give thanks. What you must do? Give thanks. Give thanks. Give thanks. Sometimes, praise God, the attacks coming from co-workers. Give thanks. But my neighbors. Come Give on, thanks. somebody. Oh, praise God. Sometimes the attack coming from all directions. Give thanks. But I hear God say yeah. to tell you, to remind you. Give thanks. Give thanks. Yeah. Give thanks. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. You know, sometimes when you got to learn to give thanks also, when you don't feel like giving thanks. Come on. Yes, yes. Oh, my God. That again. Sometimes you don't feel like you want to give thanks. Right. But did you know that that's the time give thanks. that you must press through? Come on. And give thanks. Anytime you don't feel like praising God. Food. That's the time you got to praise God. Yes. Amen. Because we are not saved by our feelings. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We are not saved by our feelings. Yes. We are saved by grace. Thank praise you. God. Hallelujah. I agree. Through faith in the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Oh, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. When you feel like the enemy is all around you. Like the enemy all over you. Uh, the, one of the ways that you can conquer him is when you start praising God. Because the enemy don't want you to praise God when you're going through. Come on, just turn around and tell somebody, praise him and Oh. Praise him anyhow. Praise God anyhow. Praise anyhow. him anyhow. anyhow. You don't feel like praising him today. Praise but him praise anyhow. him. You might, you, you might not see somebody that you thought was going to be at church today. 
But that's all right. They must know why they're not at church. Yeah. Come on, somebody. There are some folks that will tell lies. Come on, somebody. There will, there will be some folks that will make some stories. Just not to be in the house of God. But I thank God today that I am in the house of God. Yeah. Hallelujah. 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 Oh, praise God. There's a whole lot of excuses going on today for why people are not back in church. How people are not committed and dedicated like they used to be. Come on, some of, some of them are still blaming COVID. Come on. Some of them are still blaming pandemic. Still here. There was a time that, that the church was scaled down to 10. Can you see that the church gone right back, going right back to the 10 without lockdown? Because people, people have allowed the cares of this world. People have allowed the flesh to rule them. Come on, somebody. People are not sold out and dedicated and committed like they used to be until they get in trouble. Let me say that again. I can't hear you. Until they get in trouble. Until they get in trouble. Then they find back the church. When everything is going good. Come on, you're not seeing some folks anymore. Oh, praise God. They're not sick. They're not crippled. And they're not dead. They're still around. But they're finding every excuse. But they won't find no excuse to go to the beach. They won't find no excuse to go to the, to the supermarket. Or go wherever they want to go. But when it comes to coming into the the house of God it's like it's a burden but I, I don't know about you until the last breath I have I will continue to serve the Lord with gladness hallelujah hallelujah oh praise God hallelujah so one of the ways to conquer the enemy is to give him give God praise I want you to tell three persons, don't let nobody or nothing steal your joy. Don't let nobody steal your joy. Come on, tell somebody else, don't let nobody steal your joy. Don't let nobody steal your joy. Hebrews 13, 15 to 16 tells us, therefore, by him let us continually that's the key word Ambrose Steve let us continually offer the sacrifice of praise to God Hebrews 13 15 and 16 that is the fruit of our lips you heard about fruit this morning that is the fruit of our lips Giving thanks to his name. How many of you can say God is speaking in this church? Yes, once more, once more. How many of you can say God is speaking in this church? When can we say it's a sacrifice to the Lord? That's when you don't feel like you want to praise God. You don't feel like you want to do anything you even come to church and you feel like you don't want to knock the drums you feel like you don't want to play the keyboard come on come on you feel praise God like you don't want to do anything like how I'm gonna take Shaq off the drums because he don't feel like playing the drums for me today oh praise God come on Shaq praise the Lord oh praise the Lord Somebody praise the Lord. Somebody praise the Lord. Somebody praise the Lord. Somebody praise the Lord. Come here, young man. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here, young man. When you feel and you're ready to play the drum again, then you let Bishop know. Sit down there. Praise the Lord. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. We got to groom these young people too we got to groom these children we got to let them know praise God that if they're going to do something they're going to do it wholeheartedly 
If you don't train them right, then they're going to do it when they want to do it, how they want to do it. Oh, praise the Lord. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Somebody raise your hands. Come on, everybody. Children, everybody raise those hands. And I just want, to, want you to say thank you, Lord. I just want you to say thank you, Lord. Come on, I just want you to say thank you, Lord. Oh, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. 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 We acknowledge God by the fruit of our lips. We confess and glorify Him with our lips. Amen. You praise Him. Listen to me, Church of God. You must remember to praise God for the precious promises in His words to you. Amen. Hallelujah. You must remember to praise Him when the going is good and when the going is bad. Yes, you still find time to praise God. Hallelujah. One of the times that you must praise God is when he's doing a refining work in your life. Yes. Sometimes God is allowing you to go through a test. Come on. Sometimes God is allowing you to go through something. Sometimes God is pushing your button. God is allowing you to go through because he's refining you. Oh, come on somebody. He's burning out something inside of you. Come on. Come on. Oh, praise God. Hallelujah. Sometimes he's burning out unforgiveness. Come on, somebody. Sometimes he's burning out malice. Yes, yes. Praise God. Sometimes he's burning out anger. Burn out. Oh, some of you are not going to praise burn God out. now. Burn out. Sometimes he's burning out. Oh, some doubt and fear. Come on. Praise God. Allow God to burn it out. But while he is burning it out, you praise him anyhow. Hallelujah. You praise him anyhow. Oh, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise Him. Thank God for Jesus. Praise Him because He has risen you up and seated you with Jesus in heavenly places. Oh, praise God. How many of you are glad to be born again? Oh, don't let nothing distract you. I always say, don't let nothing distract you from your praise and God. Sometimes you can get distracted and you miss your blessing. Come on, Come on somebody. Hallelujah. I refuse to be distracted by anything or anybody. I come to praise God and I'm going to praise God. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I come to praise the Lord and I'm going to praise Him. Hallelujah. Oh, praise God. You must praise him because he's made you more than a conqueror. Come on. Oh. Come on. You, see if you, you see if you know that you're more than a conqueror, you will be praising God like you're great. You know, sometimes folks, let me talk to some of them on social media. For who is on it, who will be watching. Sometimes folks don't have no praise, you know, unless they see a crowd. They have to be stimulated by external stimuli. But when you know God for yourself, uh, yes, when you know that God has done a miracle for you, yes. when you know that you were sick and if it wasn't for God, you wouldn't be here today. Come on. When you know that the doctors gave you a report, uh, yeah. when you know that they sent you for the blood works and the lab yes. works, uh, and when you know that everything come back, came back negative, uh, come on. you got to have your own praise. Yes. Uh, uh, when you know that you didn't know where the food was coming from, yes. uh, and when the cupboard were empty, the fridge were empty. Yeah. And all of a sudden, God made a way out of no way. Oh, oh my God. Now, can I get a witness in here? Hallelujah. Now, I say, can I get a witness in here? Yeah. Now, he's still Jehovah Jireh. He's still in the providing business. Yeah. Tell me if you don't have a praise. Come on. Tell me if you shouldn't praise God. Yeah. Now, tell me if you don't have something to thank God for. Now, why don't you get up on your feet and give God a praise of praise. Uh, Hallelujah. Open your mouth like you don't care. Uh, uh, open your mouth like it's a thousand of you. Yes. Like it's a thousand of you. And Hallelujah. give God praise. Give him praise. Uh, give him praise. Uh, give him praise. As I said before, people are not dedicated. 
There is some folks today, their mind is on all kinds of things. Come on. You got some church folks, some women, and some men. The flesh is ruling them. The flesh is burning them. Come on, somebody. Uh, they're making the, the, the dictates of the flesh uh, cause them to can't live for God. Come on, Come on somebody. Uh, Oh, praise the Lord. Can I preach in here? Yes, Can I preach in here? There's a lot of folks that are weak in the faith. Uh, oh, glory be to God. Yes. They will tell you I'm water baptized. Uh, they will tell you that I am water baptized. Uh, and I've been in the church for 20 years, uh, 15 years, 11 Amen. years. Uh, but they're still not committed to God. Uh, they're still not crucified at flesh. Uh, that flesh is still burning them. Uh, Oh, glory be flesh for young boys, flesh for young girls. Oh, praise God, hallelujah. You got some that is taking the babies off of the breast milk. Come on, somebody. Come on. Taking the babies off of the breast milk. Come on. Oh, Come on. my God, talking about grown women oh, and God. grown men are, 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 are craving and have a desire for little baby boys and girls uh, that could be their great great grandchildren. Yes. Oh God, the Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost. Uh, the Come desires on. of the flesh. Come on. The desires Come of on. the flesh. Oh, is destroying many in our churches today. They have no desire for holiness. They have no reverence or fear of God. Hallelujah, until they get sick, until something happens to them, and then they want to be committed, and then they want to be sold out to God, as if God is mocked. God is not mocked. Let us praise God in the good times. Let us praise God in the bad times. Let us praise God when you're on the mountain. Learn to praise God when you're down in the valley. Yes. Learn to praise God when your friend come at church. Come on. Learn to praise God when your friend come at church. Yes. Learn to praise God when the church have plenty of people. Come on. Learn to praise God when it's only a handful of us. Go praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Somebody shout hallelujah. Somebody shout hallelujah. Don't let nobody steal your joy. That's the word for the hour. Don't let nobody steal your joy. Hallelujah. Praise him as your healer. Come on, somebody. I know that if it's even one of you, you come to church to praise God. Praise him as your healer. Yes. The healer. The healer. Hallelujah. You know, I'm going to call on Deaconess Powell to come give a powerful testimony. Oh, praise God. We must give God the glory and the praise. Come on. Come, Deaconess. About what God has done for us. Some of you can recall. Come on, and you can talk with power and authority. Some of you can recall how she had that lump. How she had a big thyroid problem. And when she came to church, I anointed her. I anointed her neck. And I said, Listen, you are healed from today. Oh, praise the Lord. And by two or three days, the lump disappeared. Let's give God glory and praise, no man. Come on, come on, come on up, come on. Give God glory and praise. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God. Let her tell you about what God did for her after the prophetic word. I think it was before Easter when I was on the road and feel the lump. It wasn't really big at the time, but it was paining me. And then after it was paining me, I went to the doctor. I do some tests, tests come back that it is 
whatever centimeters. I was supposed to go up by university hospital. When I went up by university hospital, the morning in July, they could not find my name. They said, my name is not in the system. I said, thank you, God, you're working. That's the first sign. When I went to three different places, it wasn't in the system. And when I went, I finally get through and go to the doctor. The doctor looked at me. She did what she had to do. And then after that, she said to me, I don't see anything you are healed. I said, in the name on, of Jesus Christ, the the name of Jesus. there were some instruments in her office. And she said to me, how are you looking at those instruments? You think you are going to do a surgery? I said, in the name of Jesus, I'm not doing any surgery. And then when she looked at me, she said, take this paper down to the office. When I went to the office, they just gave her back the paper and said, you are to go home. You are not supposed to come back. If anything happens, you can come back in a year's time. So here I am standing on God's promises. I believe in the word of God that healing is our to the children's bread. Because whatever God says, he will do it. He is not a God to lie. He will not lie and his word cannot return to him void. Brethren, let me tell you something. Try the man called Jesus. He will not fail you. God never fails. I am a representative of God standing here knowing that God healed my body. He has healed me in so many, many ways. But thanks be to God, I am here standing on the promises of God. In Jesus' name, amen. Let's give God the praise. Let's give God the praise. Let's give God the praise. Let's give God. Come on and clap your hands for the Lord. Hallelujah. 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 God is to be praised. Hallelujah. Nice to see Bishop and Evangelist. God bless you. Praise the Lord. Let's clap them. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. 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 God is moving. I say God is moving. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise him, man. Praise him. All when things don't look good, praise him. Hallelujah. All when you don't know where the gas money coming from, praise him. Come on, praise him. All when you don't know where the toll money coming from, praise him. Yeah. Hallelujah. You don't know where the next dinner coming from, praise him. Yeah. Can I get somebody in here to say something to God? Say Hallelujah. something to God. Do not love your feelings. You know, if you follow your feelings, you feel so tired. Mash up. If you follow your feelings, you feel mash up. Come on, no, come on somebody, come on. but it's in the mash up. Yeah. And it's in the tiredness. Uh, yes. That your praise is locked up. Uh, oh, come glory on. to God. Come on. Uh, come on, lift up your hands. Lift up your hands. Uh, Holy Ghost says a praise and there's a praise yeah. and there. Today is a miracle working day. It's a praise and day. Thank you. It's a day to praise. God, praise Him! Hallelujah! Not only is He a healer, but He's a sanctifier. He's your peace in the midst of the storm. Come on! He's your provider. I don't know about you. Some people come out full, full now. Some people bank account flowing. So some people do want to praise God now. Some people don't have no time for God now. Everything working out. Yes. Loans approved. Yeah, Everything nice. Come on, somebody. I don't need God anymore. Be careful. Just look at your neighbor and say, be careful. Be careful. Oh, the wheel goes around. Come on, somebody. The wheel goes around. Come on, the wheel is a circle. And what goes around comes around. Be careful. In all of your blessings and in all of your breakthroughs and in all of the things God is doing for you, remember to praise God. Yes. Remember to praise God. Some people will find all kind of excuses to why they can't give to the work of the Lord. All of a sudden they can't give the church nothing. All of a sudden they have too much bills. But when they didn't have anything, when they didn't have anything, 
anything. Uh, they trusted God and they depended on God. Come on, somebody. How many of you know that little is much when God is inside of it? Uh, and sometimes you have a lot uh, and God is not in it and it vanishes. Come on. Oh, some of you not saying anything. Oh, praise the Lord. He's your provider. He's your shepherd. Allow the joy of the Lord. God, you was exhort a Karen this morning to preach the message. To preach the message. How many you want to give the Lord a clap for what took place here this morning? Oh, God is in the midst. God is in the midst of us. Allow the joy of the Lord to well up inside of you again. Because after all, the joy of the Lord is your strength. There's a lot of things wrapped up in your praise. Let me say it again. There's a lot of things that is wrapped up in your praise. Hallelujah. That's why the enemy is after your praise. I say that's why the enemy is after your praise. Hallelujah. Give the Lord a clap. Hallelujah. There's a lot of things wrapped up. Come on, you know when you wrap up. Lock up inside of your praise. But today, somebody shout today. Today. Somebody shout today. Today. We're going to unwrap something. Unwrap, unwrap. Come on, that's right, say that's unwrap. right. Sir. We gonna unwrap something. Yes. Take your hand and unwrap it, man. Unwrap, unwrap, unwrap it. Unwrap, unwrap. Come on, man. Unwrap time. Unwrap. Yes. Yo, there's something inside of that gift there for you. There is something inside of that for you. Oh, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. As you do this, as you praise God, you will sense the very atmosphere around you beginning to change. You will sense the atmosphere around you beginning to change. It's time you learn how to break out for yourself. Some folks can't break out unless they have certain people around them. Some people can't praise God unless their best friend, their church. Come on, your best friend not coming to church, so me not go neither. Come on, somebody. But you better know God for yourself. You better know God for yourself. Sometimes you might see somebody who might not have come to church for whatever reason. And because their reason is their reason, it doesn't give you the same reason. Come on, somebody. Know God for yourself. I just need about six of you to shout, know God for yourself. No God for yourself. Come on, tell somebody else again, man. No God for yourself. No God for yourself. It's time you learn how to break out with praise. You see, there are some folks watching you. Come on, talk to me, no man. Some folks watching you to see if you're gonna fall down. My God, let me say it again, man. Folks are watching you to see you go down. But sometimes, even when it looks like it's going down, don't rejoice too quick. Come on. Don't rejoice too quick. Yes. Because something is in the making by God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Something. I feel a praise in there. Something is something. in the making. Something. God is after doing something. Yes. Evangelists, when Gideon and Bishop, when Gideon had 3,000, 3,000 men with him, God said, no, I got to show you that it's not in the majority, that I can still move in the minority once they are faithful. Come on, somebody. Once they are faithful. Oh, praise God. We don't need uh, no more religion. We don't need no more titles. We don't need no more. What we need is commitment. 
and dedication to God. We need people to be dedicated to God. Even on broken pieces, you got to be committed to God. Nowadays, every little thing blow people out of church. Even to the fan blowing people out of the church. Talk to me, somebody. Sometimes you have to wonder if you must cut off the fans them. Because they come in like they put in the good breeze in the church. And the people them just have people them just have blow out the church. No commitment. No dedication to God. Come on, somebody. When you are sold out to God, you're not easily shaken. When you are sold out to God, you don't watch nobody. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes, we have too many people with, with conditional love for God. A God that has unconditional love. We have too many people with conditional love. God, if my condition not tan good, me not go to church today. God, if you don't give me the money, when I pray about me not go to church. God, if you don't send the Western Union or the, or the money master, money, money grammar, whatever, I'm not going to church. God, I am heard that the so and so said this about me. I'm not going to church as if you and God in war. God, I'm not going to church because I don't like how the woman of God preach. I don't like how the man of God preach. So I'm not going to church. But you better know that you better be ready. Oh, praise God. If you should lose your soul, it is nobody's fault. Uh, but yeah. your own come on somebody yeah. nobody's fault uh, but your own come on somebody hallelujah oh praise god praise the lord come on somebody and praise the lord praise him hallelujah tell somebody my name is praise my name is Chris. 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 Uh, someone I say like on a don't know the name. My name is Chris. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chris. Yeah, sometimes you see me. I don't have a dime in my handbag. But my name is Chris. Come on. I say sometimes the car gas get low, but my name is Chris. Sometimes I don't feel like I want to praise God, but my name is His praise. His praise. Hallelujah. Praise. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. You see what you've got to understand as I'm getting ready to come down. There is power in praise. Come on. Come on. Are you ready now before I land the ship? Come on. Power. I'm about to duck up. Power. Ah, praise God. Brother Shaq, you ready? You ready to go back? All right, go on back. Clap him, clap him. Go on back on the job. Work with Brother Steve. Oh, praise the Lord. Ah, you got to roll with me now. Come on, somebody. I say praise sets the stage for God to move. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Stage set the stage. Praise set the stage for God to move on your behalf. Yes. Sometimes you need God to give a breakthrough. Start praising God. Come on. Oh, praise God. That's right. That's what I'm talking about. Sometimes praise God. Uh, you, you're not now shake for you. Oh, praise the Lord. Shock on fire now. Praise God. But sometimes uh, I, your praise is what set the stage for God to come down and move yes. on your behalf can i get a witness in here come on baby oh, can i get a witness in here praise releases angelic beings uh, to come and minister to you yeah. come on come on evangelist you need to come up here so you know girl because I, I i i need some help i need some extra kind of help you know oh praise god come on you gonna roll with me you know i say praise releases the angels uh, to come and minister to you. Yeah. Oh, praise the Lord. Oh, Jesus. Praise fuels joy. Come on, brother. I say praise fuels joy. Ah, praise God. Joy, joy, joy. 
Yeah, somebody shout joy. Uh, when you start, praise God, joy start to come. Uh, oh, praise God. I uh, said, when you start, praise God, uh, joy start to come. Uh, your joy start come back again when you start, praise God. Some people sit down and watching you because as long as you're not praising God, uh, they can rejoice over you. I wish that I had some help in here. Let me fix up my clothes there. Uh, I said some folks uh, wait to see you stop praising God, uh, but they're not tired to see your face. Uh, tired, tired. They're not tired to see your face. Uh, let me talk some more about praise. Praise knocked down the walls of resistance. Yeah. Why well, may I try? But it's difficult. Give him some praise, give him some praise. church we wouldn't even be on this spot of ground if I had to follow circumstances but guess what until God says so come on until God is ready I will praise my God while I'm in it come on somebody I will praise my God while I'm in it oh praise the Lord Joy, 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 joy in the Holy Ghost. Oh, why joy? Nobody's seen your joy. 
social media, wherever you are on the television, wherever you are. I want to thank God for you. On behalf of Bishop Leroy, Evangelist, Georgia Brewery, praise God, Deaconess, Amaral Powell, Exhorter, Karen Walker, Suarez Walker, down in Evans Meadows on behalf of Exhorter, Joyce Anderson, Deaconess Gale, Exhorter, Nadine, and all the other the brethren, Brother Steve, Minister, and all the brethren, all of the ushers, all of the cleaners, all of the members, praise God. I want to say, don't let nobody steal your joy, praise God. God bless you all. God bless you.